Singer Diamond Platinums has received special requests from Tanzanian government to cancel his upcoming Wasafi Festival, which is meant to take place in Nuringa. The singer has been asked to make time for the East African community's Jama Fest. The request was delivered by the Minister for Information, Culture, Arts and Sports, Harrison Mwakiembe, ahead of a mega festival that will be held in Dar es Salaam. While addressing the press, the minister said that this is the right time to show patriotism, adding that when the event was held in Uganda, all their artists were present. Former Ugandan all-female band Blue 3 member Jackie Chandiru has appealed for financial assistance from well-wishers. In a video shared on social media, a frail-looking Jackie is seen alongside a friend, events organizer Balen Barugaha. Whatever you have, just give back to Jackie. She's in great pain, but God is healing her and the doctors are doing all they can, said Barugaha in the video. Meanwhile, Jackie, who has been battling drug and substance abuse, remains mum throughout the video, occasionally unsuccessfully trying to crack a smile. Zari Hassan is irate with the rate at which critics can't tame their content that is nothing but lies. What the netizens have found out is that the man is strong in the face. The photo shared by Tanzanian blogger Jay Mad take the photo shared by Tanzanian blogger Jay Maudaku captions how the blogger thinks King B is ugly, but seems like Zari is not calling it a bluff this time around. It's an offense that has hit the most vulnerable spot of her being and has come out guns blazing. Through her Insta stories, she indirectly slams the blogger, telling him to look for something to do. Davis Mwabili, popularly known as Inspector Mwala, was on Thursday, September 19th, found guilty of causing death by dangerous driving by Maria Kani Court. Maria Kani Senior Principal Magistrate Nelly Siadalo sentenced the comedian to one year in jail or pay a 30,000 Kenan shilling fine. Mwabili, who features in popular TV drama series Inspector Mwala, however, paid the 30k fine to secure his freedom. Mwabili had attempted to overtake another vehicle, but lost control of his and veered off the road, resulting in him hitting and killing one Ismail Mangi.